when we were kids, we used to go to um, my grand's house for Diwali. Diwali is uh, brown Christmas. Fucking winter festival. Anyway, go on. <laughs> My d I've seen my dad eat brain masala before. What? Yeah, mate. Brain masala? masala. Yeah, no, I'm yeah. joking. Brain? <laughs> <laughs> my dad took us to Billingsgate Fish Market and he said, I'm just off to get something. And he came back and over his shoulder he was carrying a shark. <laughs> <laughs> it was insane. And he said, This makes great curry. He actually bought a shark? Yeah. But the other thing my dad did, which isn't as cool, is he once came home from the pub, was really hungry, and so deep fried a hard boiled egg. <laughs> what? He said, I really fancy something really bad for you. Yeah. And so he deep fried a hard boiled egg. Did he you... died of a heart attack. I don't know who, I don't know who found that surprising. <laughs> I, can't, I imagine he went, yeah. <laughs> I reckon my first girlfriend was up when I was about 14. 14? Yeah. Goodness Not me. Not serious. Rubbish. It was... And she was white. So magical. Anyway, um... <laughs> <laughs> but I, I remember one of my earliest girlfriends sort of openly was cheating on me. <laughs> how, how... How openly? Well, I should tell them, like, everyone knew. <laughs> <laughs> At what point does that stop being... The word cheating doesn't really cover that, does no, it? No, because I've changed the rules <laughs> and allowed her to do that. But I wasn't allowed to. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> when you had your first relationship at 19... Yeah, at university. You must have been super desperate and just insane, right? Yeah. I think I was, like, two weeks away from some sort of sex doll situation. Right. But so how did you meet? She was like a fresher as well, was she? I met her through uh, the debating society, right? Oh my god. Right, okay. Why are you surprised? Did you ask her out? No, it was uh, relayed to me via a third party. Oh my god. <laughs> Somebody told you that she fancied you? Is that what happened? <laughs> At university? <laughs> <laughs> Wow. <laughs> 19 years old. You heard, you heard this sentence. <laughs> Nish, somebody else who's in debating society fancies you. <laughs> if that doesn't scream virginity, I don't know what does, mate. I went to see, do you know Ice T had a metal band called Body Cow? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, I do remember. Anyway, I went, I was slightly underage, so I bought a packet of cigarettes, so I was smoking in the queue so that the bouncers would let me in. So as I walked up to the front of the queue, he said, I need to search you. Searched me and said, what is this, mate? And pulled from my pocket a packet of hobnobs. <laughs> Take. I was quite overweight. I, I just like to have biscuits with me at all time. <laughs> <laughs> and, he, and, and he just went, he just went, just go in, mate. 